frosty morning. Check this out. about lunchtime and have had a pretty easy day today kind of walking through the suburbs through the country and um, we already did a couple hours of walking we're only gonna do a couple hours more I mean all in all pretty simple day pretty straightforward great weather lots of little towns I'm gonna stop at the uh, supermarket up ahead because tomorrow is Sunday everything will be closed to stop at the supermarket load up for tomorrow. But other than that, that's about it. We are walking a nice little country lane right now. It's off of the bike path. The bike path was going pretty far out of the way to this other town. Uh, so I decided just to cut off some distance. It should save us about an hour so I can relax a little bit more, take a little bit slower. And it's just as good walking. Uh, there's no one on here, so very peaceful. This village is insanely beautiful. saw that there was a large swath of woods up ahead so I planned on ending here where I am now uh, but I get here and everything just outside the road is fenced off I don't know if you can see it but there's a fence with some barbed wire up there and it's a big patch of woods it's gonna be probably an hour to get through maybe a little longer um, yeah, and I was really kind of hoping I'd be able to find a place to sleep here easily, but figure something else out. On the plus side, it's super peaceful. There's nothing here. Just saw some deer. Find something. That wild boars sleep in there. So I know not to sleep around here. Not that I can get in anyway, but let me show you. You can kind of see the way the, the ground is uh, turned up. And it's kind of like, almost like dogs in a little bit, the way they dig. 
um, but it's more like cold the ground and uh, so yeah you can see pretty clearly that it's uh, it's gonna be a lot of wild boars here at night okay so we're ending the day on the hilltop we haven't seen anyone in I don't know, an hour and a half uh, there's a villa a big villa over there a villa over there there's no one in them um, so I'm going to camp right beside the road. There's a, a French Way sign. I mean, it'll be fine. There's not, there's nothing around here. And there's a national park behind us. Um, yeah. It's a good day. So you can see I'm sweating a little bit from pushing uphill. A little humid. Um, yeah, really good day. Very good day. And so one reason besides taking a vacation to Mallorca that I'm excited for my friend to come. It's because my tent pole, even though I bought a, a new piece for it, is just busted and getting worse and worse. I got a, what do you got, let's say. I got a tent stake, duct tape, and zip tied to it. And it's gotta last three more nights. Three more nights to Florence, and then I get the whole new piece. And so here is, this is the, the piece I bought back in Naples, but it's just like half a millimeter too small. And last night, the original, this original piece split. So I'm gonna duct tape this and kind of jam it back in there. And like I said, it's gotta last three more nights 